Hey guys, what's up? It is the Chinchilla Notebook here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is going to be a video on understanding your chinchilla's behavior. I was really hesitant about making this video for a long time because I was worried that I didn't really have all the right facts and like I didn't do enough research into it onto the internet, just looked everywhere and found a lot of different information on understanding chinchilla behavior and that is what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to be sharing with you guys what certain behaviors of your chinchilla mean and how you can understand them. Obviously every chinchilla is different, they all have different personalities and characters and some of these things might be completely opposite of what they are with most chins so I just wanted to let that out as a little disclaimer and I hope that you guys find this video helpful but also keep in mind that it's different for every chin out there. So jumping right into the video, the first thing is squeaking. I'm sure you guys have heard chinchilla squeak before. I wish I had sounds of what it sounded like, but I never, never can record them, you know? But it does happen sometimes. It happens a lot at night. And the reason for this is they're either responding to you or calling out for attention. Merlin does this all the time when he wants attention. And when I didn't know what it meant, I used to always check on him to make sure he was okay. And all he would be doing is up here at the bars just begging for a treat, begging to be let out, things like that. So... A lot of the times when you hear a chinchilla squeak and it's very funny sounding, that means they probably just want attention or are responding to you. The next sound that chinchillas make is barking. And barking with Merlin at least only happens when he's angry and he just like actually barks at me. I'm sure if you've had a chinchilla, you have heard a chinchilla bark before. It's super small, super tiny, but it sounds like a barking sound. And Merlin only does it when he's angry. I've never heard of other chinchillas doing it besides when they were angry too, so I think that's mostly with every chin that they bark when they're mad. An angry chinchilla is, so if you see your chinchilla making a small growling noise that's similar to the barking and barking as well, um, usually they're going to be wagging their tail side to side and then also if they stand up on their hind legs and spray urine at you, obviously that is a huge sign of hostility. But basically when chinchillas are angry, they're just going to be making these little growling noises and some chinchillas wag their tail when they're happy. Merlin never does that when he's happy. He only does that when he's getting irritated or he's angry at me for something. And it's usually if I try to hold him or pick him up and then he'll just bark at me and then wag his tail really fast and make this little like noise like he's really, you know, unhappy with me. So that's what anger usually looks like when it comes to chinchillas. The next behavior is relaxed. So when chinchillas are relaxed, they move slowly around their cage, they groom themselves, sniff around casually. They're like kind of like how Merlin's doing right now. He's not super, you know, stressed out. He's just relaxed. He's not doing much. Next one is being frightened. And this one's pretty obvious. If your chinchilla is hiding away, if they're just running into all their little hideaways, running away from you and um, shaking even, that could mean that they're scared and frightened. And then also fur chewing. Merlin doesn't do this when he's scared. He's just, he hides and then just stays very still when he's scared. So that's what Merlin does. Next one is how to know that your chinchilla is happy. And this is when they interact with you. They eat well, hop around, and you know, chew toys. Basically just, oh, he's so cute. Basically just casual behavior is your chinchilla being happy you know and content and you know if they just want a lot of attention from you and they're just being really friendly that could also mean that they're very happy the next one is being alert and the way that you can tell your, your chinchilla is really alert is when they're standing very still and straight after hearing or a sound or like smelling something Merlin does this a lot he just like suddenly just sits up and he just perks his ears and just sits very still and doesn't move a muscle for the longest time because he is alert and he sensed something or he heard or smelled something. The last one is when chinchillas are tired. So their ears go down, their eyes droop, and they move around a lot less. This happens a lot in the day. I'll come in here and Merlin's just, his eyes are closed or almost closed and then his ears are drooping because he's tired. It's a very quick video, but I just kind of wanted to share it with you and kind of all the behaviors and different moods that your chinchilla could be in. So if your chinchilla does any of these, this is how you can kind of understand what kind of mood they're in. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one.